2023 predictions for entertainment. MSM versus Twitter. One too many versus many too many. Receiving information without the ability to respond to it. TV, I cannot respond. Versus being able to be a part of the conversation. Everyone's something, someone. Thank you. What do you got? So I think that for years now, the major uh, media, like the major centralized media agencies have been losing traction. You, you know, the, the invention of YouTube and the age of social media uh, gave everybody a platform. Everybody has their own channel. Um, now, I think that those, a lot of those, like we know that the big, two of the big six media companies in the world is Facebook and Google. However, and they own YouTube and Instagram, yada, yada. It's a big tentacle monster, really, is what it is, right? <laughs> um, but I think they lost control of their own system. And, every, and something, something organic is happening that can't be orchestrated or controlled, and that's individual people desiring, deeply desiring to, to share their message and their story with each other and to, to connect So you think that's enough pressure for the big tech to start loosening up a little bit the censorship? I, I think that, no, I think the opposite is happening, actually. More censorship. I think they're going to try to crack down more. It's, uh, you know, the... the but I can go to Twitter. Sure, you can go to Twitter. You can create your own platform, and, and, and competition is coming, is rising up. Rumble and BitChute and things like that. The more censorship, I think that they're losing control, and that they're, the effect will be the attempt to create more censorship, but I think that it's going to have the opposite of the desired effect. You know, more top-heavy control, like the, when there's like a, you think about the shape of a pyramid, right? You know, you know who uses that as their, uh, you know, as their their model. But th there's more stones at the bottom of a pyramid holding up that capstone. There's very little energy. There's very little weight at the top. So a top-heavy system works great when it when it allows the you know the the larger segments to push it upwards. But when it starts applying pressure downwards, then the whole system destabilizes and falls apart. So when the few try to control the many with force, they lose their power. Whereas when the, if they try to uplift them, you know, that's another story. But if you've got someone riding on your shoulders and they're kicking you, you're giving them a piggyback and they're kicking you, you're gonna drop them, right? 